Located at the Hamilton Airport, the Canadian Warplane Heritage Museum houses one of the largest collections of aircraft in the region. Warplane Heritage Museum was founded 40 years ago by four gentlemen who wanted to own and fly a big aircraft. They realized that by putting the plane into a museum status, they could avoid the insurances and the taxes that were involved in civil aviation. Soon realized that by people coming in to watch their exhibits grow, they could actually make money. The museum is home to 42 vintage aircraft, many of which are in flying condition. Maintaining these aircraft is expensive. Some of these airplanes will use $1,000 and a half a day in fuel if they're on, a, on the flight. So it's very expensive to keep them in the parts. The money for these costs is mostly raised by the museum. In addition to allowing visitors, the museum rents out their building and sells rides on some of their planes. Many of these planes are quite uncommon. For example, there are only two Avro Lancasters in the world that are still able to fly. One is in Hamilton and the other is in England. Our budget today is in the $5 million a year bracket. We get very little help from any main source of government. We raise $5 million on our own every year to keep this place going. With much of their budget spent on maintenance, the museum relies largely on volunteers. Our total staff is less than 30 paid people. We have several thousands of members, probably 300 of those members are volunteers. They are the backbone that makes this place work. They are the tour guides, they are the engineers. And if you had to pay the hours, we could not afford it. They're looking at probably half a million dollars in, in actual labor that is donated free. The aircraft are obtained through various means. Some are bought, but many are donated. In a few cases, wealthy benefactors bought planes specifically to give to the museum. The museum stands as a shrine to Canadian aviation, and tens of thousands of visitors come through every year. But what motivates the volunteers to keep coming back? Because the people here love old aircraft, love being around old aircraft. We just have that, that something inside of us. It's why do people like Chevrolet cars? They, they have a, a thing for that car. We have things for old airplanes. For 519 Online News, I'm Nathan Cox.